Hey, good morning everyone. Uh, we are gonna be discussing fuel system on this video vlog number two. Um, I'll be showing you guys the uh, different kind of system for this Honda S2000. Um, the uh, 2000 to 2005 have a, uh, uh, a return system and the 2006 through 2009 have a return last fuel system and this um this particular car i have a 2006 so it's a it's a returnless well it was returnless but um i'll be discussing you uh, the difference on both of them okay guys i'll be showing you guys the stock 2006 through 2009 uh, returnless system so uh basically there's only a feed line from pump there's only a feed line through the fuel rail so uh, the design and the uh, the pump hanger, they cut off the um, the feed on I mean the return line, and they back it off. So you cannot really um, drill one and reuse it. Um, and the rail also the design on it is there's no FPR, and there's no return uh, system on it. Now there's no uh, return uh, line to put it in. So. Um, the problem on this specific return system is when you, when you, um, making more than four hundred fifty horsepower on a uh, on boost, it's harder to tune them because of the pressure drop. Uh, Honda showed a video about this issue, and a lot of um, and a lot of uh, tuners, especially Evans tuning, uh, suggested that before you guys go to get tuned you guys need to make sure that your power goal is um how you call it? your 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 fuel system is capable of your power goal that you wanted before you go to the dyno so if you are making if you want to make more than 500 i suggested to change this to a return system so um what i did is um i bought a uh, sos fuel return system basically it's like a OEM design it uses the OEM lines on the OEM 2000 through 2005 um, hanger so um, I didn't use it I bought it but I didn't use it because I changed my mind so um, what I did next is um, uh, what I bought next is I did bought a dash 8 dash 10 lines FPR, FPR and fuel filter and aftermarket rail. So um, this is the second one I bought, and I put it in on the stock 2000 to 2005 hanger. But the but I still had issues on it this year, so uh, I'll be changing it again. This is gonna be my third fuel system that's coming in. Um, the pro the problem I had on this one is um, the uh, the lines, it's dash ten feed and dash eight return. They are way way too big for the stock hanger because the stock hanger size is three eight, so it's equ equivalent to uh, dash six. Correct me if I'm wrong. I know I know three eight dash six dash six. So um, it's harder for the fuel pump. And I only have a AEM 320 fuel pump on it, so it's harder, and and the fuel pump need to work, need need to work two times faster to fill up the lines. So when I'm when when I was boosted, the uh, the pressure could not um, that the fuel pump could not keep up to feed the injectors fuel, and um, I was running a mix uh, mix 109 and pump, so. Um, Plus I had I had it um, I had it to burn more, a lot of fuel faster fuel so um, how do you call it now um, now I'll be upgrading this hanger I just bought a um, it's not here yet but I just bought a um, full blown I just put a full blown uh, 
dual pump hanger so it's a dual pump design i bought the whole the whole kit and um i'll I, i'll be selling this uh whole fuel system to whoever is interested it's for sale by the way so it's um i was asking i, I was parting it out i wasn't selling it as a kid i did sell I, I was trying to sell it as a kid but no one no one bites so um i'll be parting that out um the the benefit on this the fuel system that i'll be getting is um it's a dual pump design so you can either put just one big 450 pump or you can put uh, two uh two 340 and you can have like 800 uh power goal so uh, you should be f uh i think that should be the last fuel system that you will need um you can pick from dash you can select what feed and return line you want so um yeah i mean if you want to make more than a thousand then i suggest dash 10 and dash 8 feed and return line if you are only making if you're only planning uh, making 500 through 800 um you should be fine with dash 8 and dash 6 and um i'll be getting a um the specific one, specific one I got is um, I, I'm getting a dash 10 uh, feed and dash 8 return, and uh, and they have and full blown full blown motorsports have their own uh, fuel pump design, so uh, I'll be getting their uh, full blown uh, 340, so I'll be doing a dual pump, dual pump uh, full blown 340 on the next fuel system, so um. I suggest when you are converting this specific uh, year of Honda's 2000 the 2006 through 2009, especially if your boost, you need to change it. So it save you time going down it twice if if you max out the stock uh, return the system. Um, there's there's a lot of option out there. SOS sells it sells the OEM style for 679 I think and for full blown it's a little bit spendy it's a 1400 and inline pro sells them also the inline pro one um, they use the uh, stock feed line to become a uh, a return line and they giving you guys a dash 6 um, braided lines to go through the 2000 to, uh, 2000 through 2005 fuel hanger um, the inline pro cost I think 749 so um, it, it it really depends on your power goals the uh, SOS should be able to handle uh, 500 through 600 I think and um, the inline pro that should be fine for about the same thing with SOS it's just the same it's just the design is more better for inline pro because it's not a OEM style but overall um full-blown motorsports the best one because i um it's a dual pump hanger design so that should be the last fuel system that you will ever need and this honda s2000 and yeah well um if you're planning to convert your fuel system make sure to shop wisely and uh don't end up like me i bought three fuel system now so um yeah good luck to you guys yeah thank you guys for watching uh, make sure you guys subscribe in my channel and follow me in my instagram make it underscore s dope for uh more updates on this honda s2000 build um there's gonna be more uh there's gonna be more parts coming in so i'll be making more videos diy or anything that uh, I am interested of doing so um, make sure you guys follow me okay thanks for watching bye